gonna show you how to do a Russian push-up or a shuttle push-up, whatever you want to call it, because I'm slightly dehydrated. And somebody forgot to get water. Anyway, so first, you want to start on your knees. What you're gonna do is you want to mimic dropping your elbows so you can understand. So be as if you're in a girl push-up. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna be here, slide back, drop your elbows, back up. Slide back, drop your elbows, back up. And something you want to keep in mind, Something you need to keep in mind is that you want to try to keep your pressure on the meaty part of your palm, which is right here. I know my hands are nasty, but it's okay. So, when you're in a shuttle push-up, what you want to do is you're down here, and you're going to slide back on your palms and back forward. You make it slightly easier by picking your butt up and using a bit more momentum by using your toes as well. But, initially, you want to be in a push-up, and of course you need to have a push-up before you do this. But you want to be in a push-up position, keep everything nice and tight, go down to the bottom of a push-up, push on the meaty part of your palm, and you slide your toes back. Again, so look at my toes. I am sliding my toes back. And then you step forward and back up. So the whole idea is that you want to use your toes and use this part right here. To make it easier, you can try doing this. What you could do is you could pick your butt up and back it. This makes it slightly easier because you're using more momentum and you're taking some of your body weight, you know, by picking your butt up. So we're gonna do this again to cheat it. Here, butt goes up, bring it forward. And that's about it. That's all you have to do. I'm dehydrated. Fuck this shit, show off. Like it, subscribe and shit.